In the first part, we journeyed through the celestial wonders of the closest stars, like Barnard's star and the illustrious Sirius. We also delved into the enigmatic local interstellar cloud, leaving us hungry for more cosmic revelations. But hold on tight, because this time we're zooming in on the captivating realms of AP Columbi, the intriguing Gliese 370 and the dazzling Castor. And just when you think it can't get any more exhilarating, we'll take a daring leap into the mysterious local bubble, where cosmic winds and unseen forces shape the destiny of the cosmos. Prepare for mind-boggling discoveries, captivating wonders, and an ending that will leave you on the edge of your seat yearning for more. And don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel to catch every enthralling chapter of this epic cosmic tale. So join us on this cosmic odyssey as we explore the uncharted territories beyond our solar system. AP Columbae Located 27.4 light-years away from Earth, this star is not your ordinary cosmic neighbor. Born a mere 40 million years ago, long after the dinosaurs left our planet, AP Columbae's origin defies the norm. It emerged from a distant region of the galaxy, approximately 450 light-years away from its present position, in a stunning display of cosmic dynamics. Ordinarily, young stars linger close to their stellar nursery for extended periods, often hundreds of millions of years. However, AP Columbi has a fascinating tale to tell. Its intriguing journey likely began in the open cluster IC 2391, a congregation of around 30 stars united by a common origin and direction of movement. But fate had other plans for this young star. Several million years ago, a catastrophic event unfolded as one of the cluster's stars exploded, causing havoc among its cosmic companions. This celestial upheaval granted AP Columbi an unexpected momentum, forcibly expelling it from its birthplace. A star that's only 13% the mass of our Sun. AP Columbi defies expectations by exhibiting four times more energy than any known celestial body of similar parameters. Furthermore, its radius surpasses the values predicted by modern stellar structure theory, adding to its enigmatic nature. Another fascinating clue to the star's mysteries lies within its spectral analysis. AP Columbi's radiation reveals an unusually high concentration of lithium, an element typically abundant in protostellar clumps. In more mature stars, lithium depletes after the initiation of a thermonuclear reaction. This abundance of lithium indicates that AP Columbi is exceptionally young and still in its early stages of formation, yet to reach the main sequence phase. The star's youthfulness renders it unstable and explosive, prone to violent outbursts and stellar mass ejections. During these episodes, its luminosity can surge by up to 10 times momentarily. These outbursts would normally pose a threat to nearby exoplanets, potentially stripping them of their atmosphere and subjecting their surfaces to sterilizing ultraviolet radiation. Observations have revealed that there are no large space objects within 4.5 astronomical units of AP Columbi, suggesting it is too young for fully-fledged planet formation. Despite this, it remains a unique cosmic body, offering crucial insights into the early evolutionary stages of stars. Gliese 370 Nestled near the orange dwarf Gliese 370, a mere 37 light-years away from our home planet, this exoplanet has captured the attention of astronomers and dreamers alike. Discovered back in 2011 through the innovative radial velocity method, Gliese 370b has piqued our curiosity with its unique characteristics. As we know, not every star is accompanied by a planetary system. Gliese 370, however, offers a delightful exception. Just 37 light years away, it houses a single exoplanet designated as Gliese 370b. This discovery marks an exciting milestone in our exploration of the cosmos. Through meticulous research, astronomers have deduced that Gliese 370b is most likely a rocky planet, boasting a mass three to four times that of our dear Earth. Its estimated radius is around 30% larger than ours, hinting at intriguing conditions on its surface. With its larger mass and size, Gliese 370b's surface gravity could be at least 40% higher than what we're accustomed to here on Earth. But fear not, intrepid spacefarers, for this celestial body still holds intriguing possibilities. Gliese 370b 
positioned at a distance of 0.26 astronomical units from its parent star, enjoys a rather comfortable spot in its star's habitable zone. If its surface's albedo value, reflectivity, is similar to Earth's, the average temperature should be around 25 degrees Celsius. A rather cozy climate, wouldn't you say? Unlike some other exoplanets, Gliese 370b is fortunate to avoid being tidally locked to its star. This means it enjoys its day-night cycle, creating an even distribution of heat across its surface. A moderately high gravity should smoothen out its terrain, potentially leading to vast, warm and shallow seas, places where life may thrive. During its discovery, Gliese 370b held high hopes for potential biological life. However, more recent research suggests that conditions might not be as idyllic as initially thought. An atmosphere with a pronounced greenhouse effect could make things challenging. While challenges exist, Gliese 370b remains a promising candidate in our search for extraterrestrial life. Its average temperature still lies within a range that once supported life on our planet during the Archean period. Castor. Picture this a captivating constellation known as Gemini, where two bright stars stand out as if they were celestial twins. These dazzling stars, called Castor A and Castor B, each have their companion, red dwarfs dancing nearby. The distance between their mass centers spans a whopping 110 astronomical units, and it takes them 445 years to complete a graceful orbital waltz. Talk about a mesmerizing dance under the cosmic disco ball. Now let's take a detour to about 600 astronomical units from Castor A and B. Here we encounter a compact binary system showcasing a pair of almost identical red dwarfs. These pint-sized stars boast a mass of about 0.6 times that of our beloved Sun and bask in a cozy surface temperature of approximately 3,900 Kelvin. They're so close together that they complete a full rotation in less than 20 hours. Talk about cosmic speed dating! Their orbital path traces an oblong elliptical trajectory, taking around 14,000 years for a full revolution. What about exoplanets, you ask? While no confirmed exoplanets have been discovered in the Castor system, astronomers have their eyes on Castor C. Detecting variations in its orbital period, scientists suspect a brown dwarf, a massive celestial body about 49 times more weighty than Jupiter, may be lurking nearby. It circles its parent star at a distance of 14 astronomical units, completing its journey every 54 years. With a bit of luck, this red dwarf's planetary entourage may include rocky exoplanets, hinting at the possibility of captivating landscapes bathed in crimson starlight. Imagine the view from one of these hypothetical exoplanets, a breathtaking skyline that could rival any artist's imagination. Crimson stars spiral in the cosmic dance, while an eternal twilight suffuses the horizon, illuminated by two dazzling stars hundreds of times brighter than our humble moon. A sight that would leave even the most seasoned stargazer in awe. Local Bubble A massive structure extending about 300 light-years contains thousands of stars scattered across the cosmos. Welcome to the Local Bubble. But hold on, this isn't your typical bubble. No, it's not filled with soap, but rather something extraordinary. The local bubble came to life around 10 to 15 million years ago when successive supernova explosions rocked the heavens. These explosive events created a giant cloud of interstellar gas, sizzling at a toasty 1 million Kelvin. Talk about one hot bubble. Due to its high temperature, the gas in the local bubble tends to expand, resulting in a density about 10 times lower than the galactic average. And guess what? This steamy gas emits X-rays, making it a cosmic showstopper. The Earth and its trusty magnetic field, along with our atmosphere, keep us safe from the harmful radiation in this fiery bubble. But guess what? The local bubble is not alone in this galactic extravaganza. Nearby, we have Bubble 1, formed by supernovae explosions around the bright star Antares. And let me tell you, these two bubbles have been celestial dance partners for eons. These stunning cosmic formations, the local bubble and its neighbors, are just a tiny glimpse into the grandeur of the universe. We have clouds of scorching hot gas, open clusters, giant nebulae, and stellar streams, all coming together to form galaxies, the building blocks of the universe, and it doesn't stop there. These galaxies combine to create galactic filaments, 
massive streams and walls stretching for billions of light years. Now that's what I call mind-blowing. And there you have it. We hope you had a blast delving into the mysteries of space with us today. If this cosmic journey left you mesmerized, make sure to hit that subscribe button so you never miss out on our future cosmic adventures. Share this mind-blowing exploration with anyone else who's as curious about the universe as you are. Together, we'll keep unraveling the secrets of the cosmos. Thank you immensely for joining us on this thrilling odyssey. Until next time, keep gazing up at the stars and keep on exploring. Stay curious, stay inspired, and let the wonders of the universe fill your soul.